G'day guys. I mentioned in my last video that I'm building a new kitchen at home and before I get started I need to upgrade a few tools to make the job easier. I've already put together a quick and easy track saw video, there's a link below in the description of that one, and in this video I'll be making a table for the drill press. This is by no means an elaborate version, but it will suit the purpose and give me an opportunity to learn what improvements I can work on when I get around to version 2. I'm using melamine because I already have a few sheets here ready for the kitchen build and after settling on a size of about 600 by 400 millimetres I cut the tabletop. Then I marked the centre on the original table and the new tabletop before using a point of a countersink bit to line them both up. After clamping the melamine to the drill press, I trace the shape of the original tabletop onto the new top. The next step is to extend the lines out I had just marked, making sure the gap is exactly the same at both ends. This allowed me to screw two guide rails to the underside of the table. Ideally these guide rails need to be tight enough to stop side to side movement but still allow for easy adjustment backwards and forwards. I've extended the rails past the end of the tabletop to help reduce slop when the table is adjusted in its forward position. I then pre-drilled some holes for the bolts that will make up part of the clamping system and used a spade bit to recess the bolt heads. I don't have a depth stop on my drill press yet so I just used a bolt head to make sure I had enough clearance. I've drilled two sets of holes so I have more adjustment in the clamping setup. This way I can use either set of holes depending on where I need the fence located. A piece of steel flat bar is the basis for the clamp. I drilled some holes at both ends and then fitted bolts through the table and located the flat bar in place. I then screwed the nuts on and tack welded them to the bar. Welding them is not completely necessary, but it does make it easier to adjust the table position by loosening the bolts from the top without having to use a spanner or a socket from underneath as well. And just a quick test fit before I go any further. So the last thing I need to do is fit the fence and I used a scrap piece of aluminium angle I had lying around. I lined it up with a square and screwed it in place. And that's it, another project ticked off the list. As I said this is only a simple version but it will make building the kitchen so much easier. Thanks again for watching. 